That's right. We're here with breaking news just outside the secret entrance to the laboratories for tactical comms. I'm told by experts that they have something that's truly unique in the communications world, and that's a Bofeng that does what it's supposed to do. Cheap Chinese radios are known for a negative connotation in the emergency and prepper communications world. Bofeng is no exception, but researchers at Tactical Comms Labs have found maybe this is a little bit premature. So we set out here at the labs to find out if this radio was in fact capable of producing 10 watts or if it was just another marketing gimmick. And I'm pleased to report that on two meters, it was uh, transmitting close to 12 watts of power on a full charge battery. Uh, the received sensitivity was also uh, 0.20 microvolts or better, and in some cases we found it to be closer to 0.15. The cons to it, I thought the size and the weight uh, were something that really uh, might not attract a lot of users, but it was a good radio otherwise. So if you're in the market for an analog-only brick uh, that does put out 10 watts or better on VHF, then this may be the radio for you. Now, while technicians tell me that there's still a lot to learn about this unique experience, they're hesitant to recommend one way or the other. Now, as to whether or not an AR-152 is right for you, we recommend consulting your systems operator to be sure. With Tactical News Network, I'm Merlin Jacks.